I think the worst may have passed already now. I'm not sure, but I'm amazed that there's still electricity here. <laughs> it's flickered on and off. Yeah, something fell. You hear the bang. Um, the electricity has flickered on and off. I don't know, hundreds of times, thousand times, I don't know how many, how many times. I unplugged my laptop and everything so that the transformer wouldn't get busted. But you see the you see the electric mains going from the transformer box on the pole under that green uh, the fence, whatever that thing is with the green mesh that got ripped off the top of that building. It was surrounding that green area on top of that building. And the tops of whatever that thing is, is leaning on the building to the left of me. If those things had been slightly shorter, they would have ripped off the power lines, which presumably either goes to this building or just would have shorted out the whole damn thing. But amazingly, there's still power. So anyway, very nice experience, interesting. Although, of course, I feel bad for anyone who was right at you know, the edge of of the coast like I'm I'm pretty much surrounded by ocean but it's a small island just off uh, city center of Osaka but surrounded by buildings which take the brunt of the of the winds so I wonder I'm not sure if that's something falling or if it's electricity that's crackling from lines shorting. Can't quite tell. I guess I can tell tomorrow when I go outside. Anyway. It's still strong winds. You'd still get knocked off your feet, but it's less than it was when it was really really powerful yeah all these booms and bangs uh, i don't know it's stuff still getting ripped off by the wind or bouncing between buildings or is it electricity oh, i don't know can't find out today but anyway very interesting to experience this